Welcome back to Let's Play Kirby's Dream Collection, episode 31. Aw, they're gonna make a little snowman. <laughs> that was adorable. This is the final level in the game. Oh no. It's so sad that such a great game has to be so short. No kidding. Isn't that always the case? The best, the best games are the ones that just are you just can't get enough of. Yeah, and then they're over, and then you're and then you're sad, and you wait for the sequel, and then the sequel's not that good, and then oh man, you just go back to the original game again because it's so much better. There's a, there's a lot to love in this game. Anyway, uh, we are helping uh, Kogoesos this time. Mm hmm. Sure. Uh, this is. Uh, Another flower one, because the first stage is always a flower stage. Oh, is that true? Don't. Yep. Oh. So the first time we had to not trample on the tulips, second time we had to use pitch to to clean them and use water to grow them. Oh, yeah. The third time we had we had to kill the flowers and save the <laughs> fungi. <laughs> and then the fourth time we had to do all that bullshit with the feather duster. Mm-hmm. And now this time, we gotta use fire. What? Because these flowers are frozen. Oh! Oh, look at that! Save the flowers. One, one through ought to do it though. Just, just, just one. <laughs> one. Burn through trample. One. Ah. Uh. One. But I do want to get a friend though, just to make the rest of the level easier. Who can we go with? Let's see. Uh, Rick or Pitch? Uh, probably Frickin the one that breathes fire. Yeah. Yeah, I think I'd have a bit more uh, control over my fire blasts with Rick than with Pitch. His Pitch turns into a fireball that will probably trample him on the way back to me. <laughs> hey, wait a minute. Those fire guys are walking over the plant. Yeah, they shouldn't. Have... It, it, whatever. Oh, yeah, you did it. You saved the flowers. Uh. All right, let's finish the level now. Oh, is it... Is it slowly becoming a snowstorm here? I think so, yeah. Oh, I loved it when Yoshi's Island did this, and I, I love it when any game does that, but Yoshi's Island is one of my fondest memories, and now I'll add this to the list. This is great. Yeah, I think... Yeah, I think uh, Curse Dream Land 3 had a lot of the Mode 7 things that Yoshi's Island had. Oh, just being able to add layers upon layers and growing and shrinking. Yeah. I think, uh... I think some people at Nintendo argued that the real power of the Super Nintendo comes in the cartridges, not the console. Agreed. Yeah. Because that's that's where all the special chips and graphics cards are. <laughs> it's like, well, hey! we made great games! So now we got a little bit of an avalanche going on. Oh my gosh! At least a little bit of uh, flow and snow here. It's uh, kind of dangerous. What do you mean? It's just an avalanche, 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 and then nobody heard from Kirby or Rick ever again. Well, luckily we got to the end before it got too bad. I, I don't know how you're not frozen. Exactly. I was just thinking that. It was like, you cheap jerk. Mm. You sent the other flowers to their doom. Aww. Oh, I got the evil nickel. And I wanted that. I wanted that tomato. Oh, Would have really helped in this case. What? Huh? Is that what I think it is? What is it? That's a Metroid! A what? A Metroid! A what, Troid? Uh, the, well, uh, okay, here. But let me say it in a way that, you know, you probably looked up in the wiki. A Metroidophoy! Is that what we're helping? This is a Kirby game, dude. Oh, sorry. Um, sorry. I'm gonna go ahead and leave Rick here, cause uh, I, I think he'll be fine. You're. Yeah, he'll be just. Oh no! Oh, oh no! Rick! <laughs> no! Now we'll never be oh. able to help Gondamba Pfeffernoose or whatever we're going to help at the end of the day. And not a I Metroid. Me no, they're Metroids. <laughs> Are they in the <laughs> giant avalanche <laughs> that's falling right now? Actually, I really love how this level is set up. Obviously, there is an avalanche, and uh, this is not the music to have during a avalanche. <laughs> uh, uh, um, uh, it's just 
Just a uh, tuba going bob 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 bob. Doesn't doesn't sound right to me. So uh, uh, <laughs> in here, get shelter and ooh, it's like a fire shelter. Oh. Huh. It's kind of like uh, North Fair or whatever. Oh, uh, is that what they're going for? Maybe. Let's see. Who are we gonna go with this time? Wait a go minute. With pitch here. Do we have to kill Ridley to get the Metroid? No. Oh, okay. N n nothing that cool, but something just as cool, <laughs> I'd say. Oh wow. So, so we got these. Uh, oh. oh, oh, great. We got these little miniature doors in here, and we got ah! actual Metroids. They they don't hurt you, but they can grab on you. You got to use ice to kill. Ah! Just like in the game. Oh. oh, that's so clever! And you killed the Metroid! So, so there's three rooms. I gotta make sure I don't get hit by anything because I'm gonna lose my ice ability. I'm gonna have to start the whole level over again. Countdown until fight. you get hit. Let's see. Wait, are they trying to steal your power? No. Uh, see, as far as I know, they don't do anything. No, oh, okay. I think you're supposed to figure out what the hell do I want to do, but you're supposed to bring ice in here to kill them. Right. One more one more room, I'll do it. Come on. come on, come on. The countdown's still going. Will he lose his power? There's three. Three Metroids! One, two, three. You stay in place. Freeze him. There you and go. And gone. It doesn't even look like you had to kill them. It's like you just had to freeze them. Well, I guess technically as soon as you froze them, they were dead, but... That's, that's the only way to hurt them, is with ice. Right, right. I mean, you use anything else, it'll just, like, not work. Come on. Come on. There you go. Where's the door? Where's the door? It's almost there. It's gotta be. Come on, huh? No! <laughs> Bat was coming at you. Yep. And come on. <laughs> there we go. Hey, good job. <laughs> That'll work. So wait, does that mean? Ah, oh, I see that. Pep oh! Ah! No, so much you know, for that. That worked out. That worked out well. A net gain of yeah. one health point. Oh, well, never mind. Excellent. Uh, now, Curious uh, uh -huh. Me suggests you're going to meet Samus at the end of this. Don't you think that? Well, because you defeated the Metroids, uh -huh. which are the enemy of that game. Hmm. Oh my god! <laughs> Whoa! The avalanche never stopped! You just went through the volcano! You're right! Oh my god! All right, Pitch, this is not working. You're not going fast enough for me, buddy. <laughs> Come on, we made it through Lower Norfair. We can do this. Oh! Uh, no! no! Wait, does that kill you? I'm sorry, Pitch. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sorry. Remember me? <laughs> hey, yeah, it is. Did you just sacrifice a small green bird to meet me? Hey, you always kill the animals in speed runs, so suck it, Samus. She saved the animals at Harvey Relief. Okay, true. She did. Twice, because it was a race. It's a race. Hey, cool. Uh, yeah. All right. Now we're going to be flipping this asshole. Yeah, it's another mini game. I remembered this time. It's a shitty mini game. With <laughs> Chef Kawasaki. One of the biggest assholes in the entire Kirby series. Oh, does he make a return? He, he he's always showed up. He's he's a staple in the Kirby series. Oh wait, is the he the is he the chef? Like the uh, the mini boss chef? Yeah. Oh okay. Except now he's got a shitty mini game for us. Okay, he's good. A fucking asshole. <laughs> I just didn't know he had a name. I just thought he was just a chef. My bad. How does Kirby freeze ice? It's already frozen. Absolute <laughs> zero, man. Speedrun oh. tactic, speedrun uh, tactic. Uh, oh. Yeah. 
Ah, fuck. <laughs> All right, we get Gooey out because I think he's right here. Oh. Oh, I'm mistaken. Nope. Later, Gooey. Yeah. Yeah. Alrighty. Oh, fuck. Great. <laughs> Alrighty. Well, it had to happen at some point. Yep, it had, as it always does. This didn't happen when it counted, so... Whatever, I'll just take Cutter then. Anything? Uh. <laughs> I'm trying to show off uh, Gooey's p abilities, that he's got his own little sprite set. Oh, wow! That work. He works just the same as Kirby does. You know, except for the climbing on walls thing. And the going forward thing. Oh, yeah, how'd you do that? How did you change controller inputs? I have two controllers, obviously. Oh, I didn't even think of that. Oh. He, can, he dies through auto-scrolling, too, but, you know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, maybe we should have done this co-op so we can recreate Goemon's Great Adventure. Maybe we should do a Kirby game co-op. Yeah, well, I mean, co-op Kirby games are so hard to come by, especially in price. So, you know, maybe one of these days. Yeah, we, we gotta focus on the collection, though, first. True. Because we're not even done yet. Nowhere yeah. near. Still have uh, one game to go, if I'm not mistaken. Mm-hmm. Kirby 64 and the Crystal Shards. Oof. It's, uh... <laughs> It's fine. The, st stop getting hit and stay away yeah. from the Kappas. I'm fine. It's fine. It's fine. Don't worry. Don't even need. <laughs> As a saw blade yeah. is slowly coming towards you. Ah! So I'm just saying, look how far we gotta go just to get to the fucking mini game. <laughs> you keep getting hit by everything. All right. This th this <laughs> is it. I know this is it. Okay. All right. Ah, God, oh, stop. God! Uh, <laughs> still one more room! Oh, God. I thought this was actually an auto-scroller, and I thought you were about to die. <laughs> no, 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 no! <laughs> oh, Gordos. Oh, Gordos. Oh, Gordos. Okay. Come on, come on. Ah, uh, maybe he's down here. Oh. Uh, Oops, uh, no. I, I can pick a friend. <laughs> oh, please lead one of them to their deaths. Oh, Rick. Rick. Rick! Okay. <laughs> I, I mean, I am satisfied Kain, by that. Kine, why did you do that? <laughs> Kine, you ice brick of a fish. Why? <laughs> what the hell? Potted ghosts? Still over these Gordos Gordinis? here, and there. This has got to be huh. it. There we go. Here All we right. go. So these Gordos fall. They hit a note, and he hits the note. You got to figure which one made that sound. Uh, what? Wait, what? Let's go, let's go again. I, I I guess I don't understand the mini game. Gotta hit the Gordo that made that sound. It's easy, right? Uh, can you explain? Well, uh, how about if I explain it this way? Oh. In a reset. Let's try it again. Two, three, four, five. He hits three times, and then what? Each of those five Gordos make a different sound as they fall. Listen. Oh! You gotta figure out which one it was. That makes that sound. Okay. I guess... The last one's always hard. Yep, it's the fifth one. Is it? Well, wish I would have had you on my side. No, oh, I love these kinds of games, but I, to be honest, I was 
trying to hear an explanation and I knew you weren't talking and then you said, oh yeah, it's sound based. Oh, well I had my volume all the way down basically. <laughs> That's... So here's what I so here's what I did. I looked at the footage. <laughs> cause I had cause those cutaways I had to go through the stage two more times. All that shit. Two more times. So I'll look at the footage again. And that's the one! Now for now for the big one. Okay, I wasn't paying attention there. See, I, I, I forgot that too, so look at the footage. It's the second one! Hey, look at that! Let's get the fuck out of here! <laughs> Good job, Gooey. Oh, and I, I greatly appreciate that the designers thought to lower the music volume as that game is playing. Yes. So, but good on but not But not mute it. Yeah, that... Uh, that probably should have been muted. That would make it too easy. True, I mean, you're on World 5. You should be able to handle anything at this point. It's the hardest and the shittiest of the mini games. So. Mm hmm. And that's how you get distance is kind. Speedrunning tactics. He's like, hmm, hmm. He got lucky. <laughs> no one's ever completed this challenge. You must have cheated. The Lord Dark Matter is displeased. <laughs> He will come to your house tonight and kill you. I mean, visit you. This is Namatsumuri. Bless you. <laughs> He's a snail who needs a new shell. What? We gotta find a new shell for this guy. But he's this an is... ice! Now, uh, I kinda like this level, the, the, the way, uh, uh, the sort of trick to this one. You don't need kind of an umbrella, but it's just I need something. Then I forgot that that was shitty. So what you do need though is fire. Jeez. Okay. Fire is definitely needed. Yeah. Oh, oh God! Oh. oh God! Oh boy! Oh boy! Hey, a drink! Uh, drink. Uh, there we go. Bev's cold one with Got the boys. It. There we go. What the hell? Yeah. Okay. Oh. Down there, somehow. Right. Uh, not helping kind, not helping kind. <laughs> oh shit, no! <laughs> okay. Do you have to have kind? You're dead again. Well, I knew I wouldn't have enough health to go through the rest of the level, so... I'll do it right this time. Ah. Uh. Mm. Uh. Uh. Hey, wait a minute! Shouldn't those dragons be melting the ice? No, Kirby's uh, super hot ultraviolet feet are. So we got two doors hidden by ice over here, but we're gonna need Koo. Koo and fire. Alrighty. Do we have to do some dive kicks or something like that? We gotta melt some ice. Okay. I, I kind of figured by this point, but... What kind of ice will we be melting besides all of it? Well, icicles for one. Ah! 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 Ah, you panicked! You panicked! Uh, anyway, anyway, uh... <laughs> oh, the, the panic mess up. I, I know it all too well. I, I, I don't have a cool head when I uh, mess up in games. <laughs> that's, that's, that's why I don't do esports too well. That's why I die immediately when I play shooters. <laughs> no, I'm no, sure, no, he's shooting me! Ah! I, I'm sure there's like some sort of uh, like contingency plan for when you're getting shot at. You know, like a <laughs> jump or dodge or roll or whatever. When it happens to me, I go, fuck, who's- Oh, I'm dead. You throw a flashbang at your own face. It's like, no, please! I gotta do this just to- Ah! <laughs> oi! 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 
Hey, hey! There, there, there! What? No! How? There. Fine. Did it. All right. Anyway. Actually, if you lost fire, it doesn't matter because there's uh, some right in here. Oh, okay, so you have to have it here. Got it. Oh, God, that was funny. Anyway. So there's a clear you gotta use fire to burn the ice. Melt the ice, whatever. Yeah, I burn ice. Turn it to a charcoal black. Yeah, ice actually explodes when you do that. <laughs> really? Mix ice and thermite, you're gonna get a big fucking boom. <laughs> well, don't you mix anything with thermite and it blows up? Well, more so with ice, it's really unstable because something really hot and something really cold, you're not gonna- it's not gonna be good. Anyway, you gotta use choo-choo here, but don't go in the door to go up here and use fire. Then you gotta drop her off right here, and you gotta go back down, you gotta go grab Koo, and you gotta take him back up and all the way around over here. What? So he can go back down here. What? Then you drop him off here, and we'll come right back up here. Grab Choo Choo again. What? Go up this last little corridor here. Drop her and, off. And uh, we'll Wait, take what? her along. Cause then, careful up. Oh. oh, that's mean. Gotta be quick. And now we got a mini boss, and uh, fortunately, while the range is crap, it's. This is very powerful for against mini bosses. Well, you gotta get up close and personal, apparently. Three hits, gone. Cool. Choo Choo so, uh, is useful. Oh, well, well. Yeah, okay. yeah, she is. Wow. Yeah, just skip everything. Aha. Uh -huh. Not so useful here. Oh no, oh no, oh uh, god, oh jeez, uh, oh gosh darn, you're dead. You killed my girlfriend, Revenge! <laughs> revenge! Oh. I just realized that Kirby runs like Naruto. Hey! He runs like an anime ninja, oh no. <laughs> Believe it. Like, oh, like, why do people run like that? Is it like a... Like, I know it's an aerodynamic type thing, but... I don't that know. Can't... <laughs> I was never taught that. I was told just keep your chest straight. Keep it centered. Speedrun tactic. <laughs> Bow to the snail. <laughs> yeah, you just, just, need a, just need a new house, that's all. That's so nice. Kirby right. is such a nice individual. We got one more little awkward level to fit in here. This is Shiro, but we gotta go back to level three for a second. What? Why? Well, what's level five? If you think you remember so well. Uh, I, I, uh, I don't anymore. Oh, wait, you gotta have a friend. Uh-huh. A specific friend. And this time, we gotta get Shiro. Oh, Shiro's a cat. Let's get Sh a cat friend. Yeah, so we gotta get Nago. But Nago is nowhere in the level. Oh, in that level? Uh-huh. So we gotta grab Nago from a different level and bring him back here. And protect him. Save him for the entire level. Protect the cat. Protect, protect cat. The, protect the calico. <laughs> so, remember <laughs> when I said you can tell that a Kirby game is wrapping up when we're just getting rooms and enemies? Mm-hmm. Yeah, this is, uh, this is starting to look Kirby-ish on how everything is just kind of, hey, get through this place, don't die, all right? Because th the next stage is just uh, the fabled mini-boss room. Just like oh. a tower full of mini-bosses, like we got in Kirby's Adventure and Dreamland 2 and all that stuff. Oh. So this is the last actual official level that's not a whole bunch of mini-boss fights, so all we're just getting is just rooms full of enemies. Neat rooms, though. That's pretty cool. That is cool looking. By the way, I love Nago's face when he's shooting the the little pins. He's just like, I can't handle this much power, but I it's love like, it. Jeez, you, whoa, whoa, God, hey, Kirby, stop! Wait, no! I was not expecting this. Oh help! Wait, how do you get down there? 
And these are the cookies. These guys are assholes. <laughs> hey, I could go for a pep drink. Too. Oh, hey, look at this. One more, come on. Yeah. I love the stuff, Kirby. I can't oh. get it out of my head. I just, I just love the pep drink. Don't cut me off, man. See, there's every friend in here, but Nago. That's interesting. I guess, like, the kid gloves are off now? It's like, go find your own friend. Well, the, the most difficult, uh, friend quest, I guess, is the one quest that doesn't have the friend in there? Okay. Oh, I believe it. I don't think I've ever seen this much treachery in a Kirby game. You haven't played 64 yet. No, I have not. I have not I think... seen anything about Kirby 64. You will show me the uh, way. Yes, I will show you the way. I will show you the, the treacherous way. I mean, not to say Kirby games are ever that demanding, but I'd say that uh, that alongside Epic Yarn is the most demanding game to 100%. Uh, I love Epic Yarn, but getting 100%, man, is hard. Epic Yarn's fine and all, but I'd rather just play a real Kirby game. I don't know what it is. I, I really like the Yarn games. They are so much fun. These Scarfies don't explode. Oh, look. Oh. I thought that was actually kind of come down and kill you. And... Oh. I knew if I would have went up there, I would have gotten smashed and I would have died. Don't die, please. We've come this far without losing the cat. That was the freezer. No! Oh! All right! No, all right! No! 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 N no! Now it is no. time to worry, friends. Do it not is time die. To get nervous. <laughs> Do not die. <laughs> please. It's time to get worried. No! Okay. Oh well. Uh, 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 do those things hurt? No? Okay. Nothing. Ah! No! Don't die! I'm trying not to. Ah! Help! Come on, go, 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 go. Oh god, now we just have to run through every room! Oh no. god! Help! <laughs> almost, almost got it. Come We're on! Come on! Okay, okay. Come on! Where's the door with the stars? Hey, bottom on. Hey. Oh, hey! It's the angel of death. Our lives are just a meaningless existence. You're next. The cosmos knows itself, but if we are the cosmos, then who are we? What's our purpose for living? <laughs> so everybody but no, but but Nago's here. I think that'd be a clue. Wasn't that the second choo-choo we seen then? Yeah. Yeah. So then you start thinking, who's missing then? Because ah. every friend you every friend you take is gonna be like, yo, we got the right one. Oh god, here we go. Oh no! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Oh, come on! I know, I know these guys, yeah. Okay, you did it. Don't die. What we got left? Oh, which oh, is great. Alright, fine. <laughs> okay. Uh, just gotta be careful. It's just, just gotta be careful, that's all. We're gonna make it. There. Oh Whoa. no! <laughs> oh. God, are Kirby games normally this stressful? I don't know. I think it's just me. I mean, because I'm playing it, it's way more stressful. So close. So close. I think. Almost. I hope this is the longest ass tower. 
So you couldn't fit it anywhere, that's why this episode's so long. Oh, fucking great. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> no, Kappas! Back off! Uh, uh. He about threw the cutter of disappointment in my face. <gasps> oh, uh. oh, God! I will take that, I will take it. Ah. Okay, three hits is better than one. Oh, great. We've got uh, these gibdo looking motherfuckers. No, no, God, forget it! Not worth it. Almost there, it's gotta be it! This level is so fucking long! It's the last one, it's the penultimate one! Before we get to the mini-bosses, and then the final boss. And it's so mean for 100%! Yeah. Yes! yes! And you brought the wrong friend. <laughs> I don't want Nago! Alright, you two go ahead and schmooze. Now, let me get you in a little bit there closer, my dude. Yeah. Yeah. Tell her something in her ear. <laughs> Chicken is my favorite type of pie. And <laughs> well, well, that's all we got time for. We'll see you next time on Let's Play Kirby Hit It. Yep.